something meaningful Say something I don't know I wanna know you better Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy to see you all again for another great video. So in today's video, I'm going to be going back and sharing with you some clips on my birthday yesterday, which was Saturday, January 22nd, where I did a number of things for the day, self-care things for myself for the day. So I went and got my hair done, I got a massage, I just really enjoyed myself. So I just wanted to share with you a few clips from my birthday, so you will see that um, after this intro. Good morning, loves. Happy Saturday and happy 40th birthday to me. <laughs> I'm super excited, today's my birthday, so um, I am planning to have a nice, a nice, relaxing, enjoyable birthday. Um, I'm so happy to be back with you guys for another great video. So in today's video, we are going to be doing a mixture of things today, celebrating my birthday, as well as, of course, go by, going by Target and then checking out their Casa Luna bedding and see if we find any great pieces to help decorate my bed. So without further ado, let's just get right into this vlog. All right guys, so I wanna show you what I'm wearing today, my outfit of the day. I notice a lot of YouTubers do that they, where they share their outfit of the day. So I'm not wearing anything fancy, but I'm gonna turn the camera on and share with you what I'm wearing today. All right. Nothing big that I'm wearing. I'm just wearing my Nike sweatsuit, um, matching sweatsuit. So I have the hoodie on and then the Nike sweatpants. I picked up this Nike sweatsuit from Nordstrom. I think it was online and then I went and picked it up at the store. I love it, it's comfortable. Um, I love it because it's really thick and today here in Maryland, it's like 17 degrees outside so it's like freezing cold today so I definitely wanted to make sure I wore something today that was super warm I'm also wearing um, underneath a t-shirt this is a just another plain black t-shirt it is a Nike t-shirt if you can see the little symbol here sorry my mirror is it's a little bit dirty I thought I wiped it off but maybe it's um, still a little bit dirty but um, I'm wearing just a plain Nike t-shirt underneath as well and all of this together like i said the nike sweatsuits are super warm you know nice thick material and so i never feel cold when i'm wearing these and then i'm just wearing my nike sneakers these are super comfortable i picked these up a few years ago i'm sure they still sell them i think these are called the air max 97s and when i bought them they were $200 a pair, so super cute. I really love these. Like I said, very comfortable, and they match my little Nike sweatsuit. So we are getting ready to go out today. I am first gonna head to the BMW dealership to have my car serviced, um, just a simple oil change. And then after that, we are going to head to my hair appointment. I'm gonna get my hair done for my birthday. So we're gonna to head to my hair appointment and then I'm also, I also have scheduled a massage for today to get a nice deep tissue massage, 90 minute massage for my birthday, just to treat myself because I do work all the time and I think it's always important to take time out to care for yourself, treat yourself, care for your body. All right, so let's get going. Hey, good morning. Thank you. I love you guys so much. Best sons a mom could ever ask for. That looks like a beautiful breakfast. Yes. Thank you so much. guys we are here at Target let's take a look at their Casa Luna bedding line super excited 
Let's see what they got. Hey everyone, so I just pulled to the side really quick. I am inside Target now, and I actually, because today's my birthday, I actually stopped at the Starbucks counter and I got a free birthday drink. It is a chai tea latte with coconut milk, my favorite. We're gonna go ahead and head through Target. Let's take a look at their bedding and see what they have available right now um, and see if we can maybe find all the pieces, the right pieces, the right colors to decorate my master bed. If not, we will try again or try another Target. All right, let's get started. Look at this gorgeous bedding. So much to choose from. Wow. Where do we start? Where do we start? All right. So let's look over here. Now I know that we, I know that we need a fitted sheet. So let's see, let's look. So we're looking for the sheet set. So it looks like the linen sheet set is $139. I think I want to go with the linen sheet set. I want to go with a natural color because I don't want anything to be too dark. We're doing natural neutral tones. So this one's really pretty, but this is a full size and I want to get a king size. So here's a king size. Um, this is the Casa Luna linen sheet king size it says it comes with one flat sheet one fitted sheet and two king pillowcases so this looks really pretty so I think we should get this one now they have different types of sheet sets so this is the linen set and then they do have this one it's called this I hope I'm pronouncing it correctly Sapima percale sheet set so and it just has the description there that it's woven with soft and strong cotton crisp breathable percal surrounds you like a cool breeze so they have that type of sheet set as well then they also have this one it says temperature balancing sheet set and they have one here that says jersey sheet set this one kind of looks more like a really like laid back type of sheet set more casual so that's what I mostly see are those what was that I think that was about four different types of sheet sets that they have um, so temperature balancing Supima Jersey and linen I'm gonna go with the linen sheet set because I think it gives a more natural vibe to it so the linen sheet set I believe is $95, but we will double check the price. So let's get the linen sheet set. And then I do, oh, they have a linen blend comforter. That is beautiful. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is so pretty. Look at this linen. It's absolutely gorgeous. Okay, so I think we should get the linen. We could get the comforter set. Let me see what else they have. So they have quilts, a lot of different color quilts. Um, there's a linen blend quilt. This one says this is a linen blend duvet cover set so lots of quilts blend quilt then they have
have this beautiful, it says chambray cotton comforter set. That one's really pretty. I love the texture on this one. Absolutely beautiful. I'm thinking that we should get this linen blend comforter set. This is really pretty. It has down alternative. It is machine washable. Really, really gorgeous. Look at the texture on that. It's so pretty. So I'm thinking we should get this one. And just other stuff not Casa Luna let me see what's on this side let me just double check this side this is more bedding but that's thresholds not Casa Luna okay so it's just one aisle of Casa Luna bedding I just wanted to double check so we have that bedding set let's we have the linen pillowcases uh, let's see these are just more like linen pillowcases up here and there's like a lot of different colors look at all these beautiful colors to choose from absolutely gorgeous these are all of the beautiful throws look at these fabulous colors of all these throws they look so gorgeous. Look at these amazing colors. And knit blanket. So I like the knit blanket. Um, this one is really nice though. I really like this throw. And then they have these quilts. So I feel like I want to get the throw or the blanket and I'm not sure I want to get this color but then I'm not sure if I should do this color so let me see it looks so beautiful I think the knit blanket would be better to go across the whole bed so let's let's get this one Okay, so I'm gonna get this knit blanket to lay across the bed. And I really just wanna stick with all, as much neutral colors as possible. So I'm gonna get that instead of the darker colors, because I feel like if I get this, I can definitely use that type of color like all year round, like all year, every season. And then let's just grab a quilt. Let's see if we can get a matching linen blend king size quilt it is my lucky day maybe because it's my birthday <laughs> but we are finding everything in my bedding size so here is the linen blend quilt in a king size so we know that the quilt is going to go right above the sheet set and then we're going to put the blanket um, the comforter on top of the quilt and then also have the this blanket on top of the comforter. Um, yeah, I feel like I don't see. Oh, they do have silk pillowcases. Look at that. That's nice. I'm not really a big silk pillowcase person. I'm really simple, but that's really nice that they have that. That is an option. And then they also have these beautiful silk eye masks as well. But let's look at these pillows up here. So they have a few pillows that would really match. I wanna look at this one. This is really pretty. So let me just take this over here. I wonder what size this is. Yeah, 
we have this big euro pillow so i'm gonna i want to try to get two euro pillows this is a 26 by 34 euro pillow so i want to get two euro pillows so let's get two of these so there's actually two left i'm telling you it's my lucky day <laughs> so a two euro pillows And then we want to find, we got the two Euro pillows and then we want to find two, that's <laughs> for my YouTube channel. <laughs> and then we want to find, sorry, I got distracted by the, <laughs> by another person. So we got the two Euro pillows and then we want to find two other, just maybe not two, three other decorative pillows, I think. Two euro pillows is big is enough, right? Because these pillows are huge. These pillows are so big. Look at that. So I think two euro pillows is good enough. And let's see if we can find. Let's look at their decorative bedding pillows. So that was the whole Casa Luna line. So you know we have these beautiful sprays and candles and stuff up here as well. Um, but I'm not really into getting any of that right now. Just mainly just want to focus on the bedding. And so, like I said, they have beautiful comforter sets and lots of beautiful quilts. So many different color, natural color options. The fabric looks amazing on everything. So I just want to go back over everything. All these beautiful colors to choose from just so much to choose from and I really like this stripe one as well that's really pretty but I want to stick to all natural so they have all of these beautiful color options and sheets so much to choose from and then these are the blankets so absolutely gorgeous all right, so I barely have any more space in my shopping cart. <laughs> so let's recap. <laughs> so we have the comforter set. We have the linen blend quilt. We got the flat fitted sheet set. We have two Euro pillows and we have three pillows to go in front of the Euro pillows. We'll actually take this to the front. Let's check out and i have a hair appointment to go to so let's get to my hair appointment hey guys okay so i'm back in the car now i have all of this casa luna stuff that i picked up so i am now headed to my hair appointment to get my hair done for my birthday today I am going to this hair salon and spa. This is a new place that I'm trying out for the first time. So hopefully I like it. Hopefully it's nice. Hopefully they do a good job. So I'm going to head there and I will check in with you all when I get to the hair salon. so good and it looks so nice nicely trimmed at the ends he took about two inches off so looks really really good I'm loving my hair right now all right so I am just waiting I am going to get a massage up next so I'm just waiting for um, the massage therapist 
Alright, I will check in with you all shortly. All right guys, so I am here in the massage area. I just got my hair done. Everything looks fabulous. So now I'm just about to, I'm about to go ahead and start a 90 minute massage. I'm super excited. It's nice and zen and peaceful in here. So I'm just ready to enjoy my massage. I'll give you guys a quick peek of what the area of the space looks like and I'm gonna get started. All right, so I just finished my massage. It was absolutely amazing. Um, actually kind of messed up my hair <laughs> a little bit, but um, the massage was just absolutely amazing. I loved it. So I am going to stop by the mall really quick for a little bit. I just wanna see if they have any like cute sweaters for dinner this evening um, for me to wear for my birthday. I did order a really two really cute sweaters from a store online called Lulu's. I don't know if you've ever heard of that, um, but I had ordered one red sweater from them. It's like an off the shoulder type of sweater and it's really lovely, like I absolutely love it. So I ordered two more sweaters just like that off the shoulder because it is super cold in Maryland and I still want to look like really nice and elegant, um, but at the same time, I don't want to feel like I'm freezing. <laughs> so um, yeah, so I ordered those two sweaters. They're probably in the mailbox at my house but i do just want to go by nordstrom really quick and just see what all they have if they have any newer you know cute sweaters that have just come out i do have a couple of pair of really nice boots already to wear that's not something that um, i have to look for right now so let's head to nordstrom and i accidentally i think i accidentally spilled some water on my sweater my sweatshirt but let's head to nordstrom and just see what they have and i will check in with you once we get to the mall all right, so we are in Nordstrom, my favorite store. So I'm just gonna head over to the women's section and that they have over here and just see like if they have any cute sweaters. Super cute. Cute sweater by BP. This is, oh, it's only $35. Really cute. I like the color. Let's see what else they have. All right, so I'm just gonna shop shop around. see a whole lot to choose from over here so we might have to go out into the mall and check out a store inside the mall all right we are heading out into the mall um you can still see that like water stain on the front of my hoodie i didn't necessarily want to like walk through the whole mall <laughs> because this mall is so big they have four levels so I didn't really plan on like walking through the whole mall. All right, so we are in Nordstrom Rack. I really like Nordstrom. So I'm like, let me try Nordstrom Rack and see if they have anything cute. This is really cute. It's not really fancy to like go out to dinner, but it is just cute and comfortable.
right guys, so I just picked out a couple pairs of jeans. I'm in the dressing room now. These are Joe's jeans. These are my absolute favorite pair of jeans to wear. They are super comfortable. They are durable. You can wash them a hundred times and they last a long time. So about 80 bucks at Nordstrom Rack. And I just grabbed a couple of different colors. I really like, this is like the boyfriend style and they're kind of folded at the bottom there. So I really like this one. And this is just another one, same style, just different size. So I'm gonna try these on and just see see which one might look really good with my, uh, my sweater top that I have. go ahead and go into my bedding I'm so excited I went to Target and I decided to I went to Target to go ahead and shop for some bedding decor for my master bedroom behind me and I picked up some really great pieces from the Target Casa Luna collection they have some awesome pieces like I loved everything that I bought so I'm super excited to share with you what I bought and we will go ahead and actually decorate the bed and see let's see how that looks i did but also i also bought some pieces for i also bought something from home sense i also bought i also bought some things from home sense to add to the decor in the living room so i'm super excited to share that with you also i wanted to share with you i i also bought two chairs for my living room area from Pottery Barn. And I want to go ahead, I'm gonna go ahead and insert a clip in here so you can see what those chairs look like. I think they are so cute and they're a nice natural neutral color. You all know that I'm going for that nice natural neutral color theme. So I think they look absolutely beautiful. I did custom order them. So when you order furniture from Pottery Barn, most of their furniture come uh, custom upholstered. So I did custom design the chair to the fabric color that of my choice that I like. So because of that, it is gonna take some time for those chairs to come in. They should be in hopefully with by, I believe it said March, should be delivered to my house by March. So when those chairs come, I'm gonna be super excited to share those chairs with you. Only bought two chairs because I wanna see how they look, make sure I really like them, make sure I feel like the colors will tie in really nicely with my room decor and furniture that I already have. And if, I, if they turn out great and they're comfortable for me to sit in and I really like them, I am gonna order two more for my master bedroom. Um, because I really think that they will go, they will tie in like really nicely with my master bedroom furniture. So I'm gonna buy, you know, once those chairs come in, like I said, and I really like them, I'm going to buy two more for my master bedroom. I think they will look, I think they would look really nice in my master bedroom. I was gonna do like a sofa in my master bedroom, but I think that the sofa, might be too big. Um, I didn't really, like when I was shopping around, I didn't really see like a nice, like small, like medium sofa that I think would really go well over here by the window. So I changed my mind again. And so I'm thinking maybe just two chairs will look really good over here in this area. And then maybe like a coffee table in between the two chairs. Now that you all have seen my self-care me time for my birthday that I celebrated yesterday. I am gonna go ahead and turn the camera around now and I'm gonna go ahead and share with you my full Target Casa Luna collection. Super excited to try this out and go over everything with you. And also I want to, as we style the bed, I want to be able to go over with you how I'm styling the bed. I've learned a lot about how to style a bed because before I've never really styled a bed. I didn't really, you know, I used to never really think about it when I used to live, you know, in my other place. So now I, you know, have this new house and I really wanna make it feel 
like home. I want to make, I want to make it feel comfortable and luxurious feeling. I want it to look luxurious. I want it to look classic and timeless. So that's mostly why I'm going with the natural color theme because I really want everything to look like so timeless and just natural and beautiful. So I really want to make sure that we style this bed the right way and make sure that we have the right pieces. And so I'm just super excited to dive right into that with you all. So let's go ahead and get started. Let me turn this camera around and let me show you all of the bedding pieces I got and then we will style it on the bed. All right, so these are all of the pieces that I bought from Target from their Casa Luna collection to help style my master bed. And I am just super excited to, like I said, to share everything with you all. And I will absolutely make sure I link every single piece that I can down in the description box below so that if anyone is interested in any of these pieces, they can click on the link to access them. So let's just start over here. I picked up four of these king size pillows, very inexpensive, only like $14 each for each pillow um they have the firm down alternative inside of the pillow and it's supposed to be comfortable if you're laying on your back side or even if you're laying on your side so it even says on there you know aligns with your neck and it's good for your if you're if you're someone who sleeps on your back or if you're someone who sleeps on your side so i tend to be a side and a back sleeper. Um, so I thought these pillows would be great for me. They do have Casa Luna pillows, but I did, when I went online to target.com, cause I always like to read reviews before I buy anything. So when I went online to target.com, they did not have the best reviews for the Casa Luna pillows. And the Casa Luna pillows were at minimum $25 a pillow up to $30, $35 uh, for each king size pillow. So I didn't really think it was worth it to try them um, due to the um, negative reviews that I saw. So we, so I just decided to go with these. Um, these are by made by design pillows and they're all in king size. And I thought this would be a good place to start. So we're gonna go right over here. I bought this this is the Casa Luna Linen Blend Comforter Set. Now, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I really struggled with knowing if it was worth, determining whether it was worth just using the comforter or having the comforter and then inserting it into the duvet cover. And I was doing a lot of reading about, you know, which style is better, duvet or comforter you know, which one would look better, which one hold up would hold up the best. And so I really just, you know, got a lot of mixed answers from what I saw like on Pinterest and other areas. You know, some people use comforters, some people use duvets, some people use both. So I got the comforter set and then I also still got a duvet. Let me know down in the comments below if you all use a comforter or if you use a duvet or if you use both or, you know, just let me know down in the comments below. I would love to know what everyone else's thoughts and thoughts is on this. So, all right, so, but I got the Casa Luna. This is the heavyweight linen blend comforter set. So when it says linen blend, I found out that this is a mixture of linen and other material. This is not full linen. So this was actually a little bit cheaper than the full linen set. I did not, I did not, actually see any full linen like just a hundred percent linen in target in the store everything was like linen blend when it came to the comforter set however if you do want like full hundred percent linen um i think that if you go on target.com you can buy purchase items that are all linen so but this is a linen blend it is in the king size it says that you can wash this it is machine washable and it says that it is it comes with one comforter and two king shams 
And like I said, I will make sure to link the prices down in the comments below. Then I got the this gorgeous knit blanket. This is a medium weight. It says that it is also machine washable. And I mainly got this piece because I noticed that, you know, when people decorate their beds, they will put a knit blanket towards the end of their bed as part of decor. This is the Casa Luna linen sheet set. So beautiful um, linen. No, this one doesn't say linen blend, as you can see. So this is like 100% all linen is supposed to, supposed to be. It does say here 100% linen. And uh, this is also machine washable. And then I picked up these beautiful pillows. I don't know if I'm gonna put these pillows on my bed because I'm not really sure if these pillows will be too big in front of the Euro pillows, but I picked up these beautiful pillows also from Target. Now this is these pillows are not part of the Costa Luna collection. These are part of the, the Threshold collection, so they're absolutely beautiful. I just love this simple classic pattern design here across the pillows. And I bought two of these. Really like these because of the texture. They just have this beautiful beading texture across the entire front of the pillow, which is really pretty. And then the back side of the pillow just has this um, like linen blend type of texture. Looks really pretty and natural. Now I picked up this really big lumbar style, style pillow. So this is now this is not from the Costa Luna collection. This pillow is from the Hearth and Hand collection by Joanna Gaines. So I really love this pillow. Look at the detail across this pillow. It's so pretty. I love the little beading detail here. I just think it's absolutely gorgeous. And it also has that linen style texture here on this pillow as well. It's just so pretty and so natural. So I really love that. So let's move quickly over here. I have three large Euro pillows. These are king size Euro pillows. Euro pillows are 26, 26 by 26. And then I also picked up these two beautiful, more decorative accent pillows. I picked these up actually from HomeSense because I did not see any smaller pillows, smaller than 24 by 24 at Target. So I went over to HomeSense and I picked these up. So these are 20 by 20s. And these are so beautiful. I love the texture on the front of these pillows. So then I also have a linen blend quilt. Now from what I've learned, it's really important to have a quilt on your bed. I've never actually had a quilt on my bed. I've always just had the comforter and the fitted and flat sheet. But a lot of people, you know, a lot of people use a quilt on their bed as well, especially during the winter months, you know, just for added warmth. So I have this this is also a heavyweight linen blend quilt and this is in the king size it is a hundred percent cotton fill and this is also machine washable just such a beautiful natural color and i also picked up a bed skirt this is also linen blend it is a king size bed skirt and i'm just going to use this to cover the box spring because on my bed let me turn the camera around so you can see so you can see my bed. So on my bed, as you can see, the box spring is visible. So I do wanna make sure that I use a bed skirt to cover the box spring. I would say if you have like a platform style bed, you probably won't need a bed skirt, but because my box spring is so visible, I decided to go ahead and get a bed skirt. So over here, then I have, this is the, linen blend duvet cover set. Now, like I said, if you want the duvet cover set in 100% linen, I believe you can go on target.com and get this in 100% linen, but I just got the linen blend and this is also machine washable. Also, and then I also picked up this, this is a little bit different. So this is a cashmere blend quilt. I just really wanted to get this because Look at the texture on this quilt. It's so pretty. I just love the little detailing here on it. And I also wanted something that was a little bit darker to contrast against all of the neutral color tans. Do you just wanna show you these two pictures that I picked up from HomeSense? 
since I went over there really quick to get some pillows. I picked up these beautiful pictures. They were $39.99 each, and I thought these would be really, really pretty above my bed. Very, you know, simple, classic looking. Love this light colored wood here. Uh, that goes, that's the trim around the entire picture frame. And I thought that would be really nice. The pictures on the inside is also a linen blend, 100% natural fibers. And so I thought it would be really nice to have pictures that also have a linen blend texture in them as well. This is how my bed is looking right now. I did want to buy like um, two either stools or something to go here. I may end up ordering something from target.com. All right, so like I said, this is how my bed looks. I do, you know, we will continue to decorate as much as possible. I am gonna hang the pictures up here right now because I want to see how they look. And then, like I said, we will still go to Home Depot um, and take a look at their paint colors because I do want to still see about painting this wall like a green accent, um, more like an olive green type of accent. I think that would look pretty. That was all of the bedding items that I bought for my bed. So let's go ahead and get started and let's go ahead and decorate the bed. And then I want to hang these two pictures up above the bed. Let's see how that looks. And hopefully everything looks really good and ties in really nicely. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is remove all of my old bedding from my bed. So I'm gonna go ahead and remove all of the old bedding um, before we begin putting on the new bedding. So I'm so excited to decorate this bed. It's been a long time coming. So let's go ahead and get started with that. So I've removed all of the <clears throat> bedding from the bed. Um, I do already have like a um, mattress protector. This works pretty good for me, but I just wanna let you know, like if you're interested, they did have a Casa Luna, like mattress pad and, or protector if you wanted to get one. But because I already had one, I ordered this off of NordstromRack.com, so this works perfectly fine for me. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just keep my um, current mattress protector. So let's go ahead and get started. So what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna go ahead and start with the bed skirt down here where the box springs are. So I'm gonna go ahead and start there. Let's go ahead and put on the, the bed skirt. Let's see how that looks. And I will check back in with you in just a second. Okay, so before we put the mattress back down, let's take a look at this linen blend Casa Luna bed skirt. It looks really nice. It is wrinkled, of course. I don't have a steamer <laughs> to steam out the wrinkles, but if the mattress is down, you're not even gonna 
see the wrinkles there, but it looks, you know, long enough and it does feel very soft, guys. Like it is very soft. It's very lightweight, um, as you can see. Definitely looks like really nice quality for a Target brand. I really like it and it looks really good. Hopefully you can see how it looks all the way around the bed and that's how it looks there. I did not tuck it in on the sides here because on the inside of my bed, I have these like metal railing, I have this metal railing right there. So if I tuck it in, it's not really gonna hang all the way down. So I'm just gonna leave it hanging over the black metal railing and let's see how that looks. Um, but I think it looks really good. Let's go ahead and put the mattress back down and then we will move on to the other pieces. All right, so now that we have the mattress back on, we have the bed skirt on, the next piece we're going to put on is the fitted sheet. So from what I've learned about how to style your bed, it's really important to, like I said, have the bed skirt if your box spring is gonna be exposed. And then we're gonna add the fitted sheet right now and the flat sheet. So let's go ahead and do that. wanted to show you these sheets feel like amazing quality I mean very very soft I also noticed this detailing here so at the corner of each of the Casa Luna fitted sheets they have this like ribbed detailing here in the corner and it is stretchy so I think this is to definitely you know stretch over those like corner edges of the bed over there so just I love the little details that they have here and like I said, the sheets feel amazing, like really good quality. Okay, so let's take a look at the fitted sheet. It is fabulous guys it's so buttery soft so nice so comfortable i really love the way it feels and it's just really really pretty i have to tuck that one in a little bit more but it looks so nice like i love these sheets i'm actually glad that i decided to go with the, um, bedding from the costa luna collection very nice quality sheets for Target. I really like it. I also want to mention that I really like that the sheets are <clears throat> the sheets are long enough on the sides that they go they tuck under the mattress like very well. Now we're going to go ahead and add the flat sheet, which is the same material, same feel, same buttery soft feel as the fitted sheet. So let me go ahead and add the flat sheet. Okay, so I've added the flat sheet on top. Looks really good. So now I'm gonna go ahead and add one of the quilts on top of the flat sheet, which is what I've learned, you know, as part of styling the bed, it's really good to have a quilt on top of the flat sheet um, for added texture and also warmth, especially during the winter season. All right, so I do have two different quilts. I have this neutral, more tan colored one, and then I also have the darker brown one. So I'm going to actually use this one as more of a fitted quilt for the bed, and then we're gonna use this one to layer at the end of the bed.
Now that we have the uh, first fitted quilt on here or layered quilt, um, we're gonna go ahead and add the second quilt. We're gonna go ahead and add the second quilt and put that on the bed. So I added the second quilt at the end of the bed. So I was using the second quilt for more of like a layering effect to make the bed look more full and also more fluffy. So now that we've added those two pieces, we're gonna go ahead and add pillows to the front part of the bed. I actually really like the comforter. Even though I bought the duvet cover, it is an option to use the duvet cover let me see how the bed looks with just the comforter. And then if, you know, if we want, I can, if we want, I can still add the duvet cover with the comforter. All right, so hopefully this looks okay. Now I'm gonna go ahead and add the other quilt on top of the comforter. All right, so now that we've added the comforter and then the other quilt on top of the comforter to layer it at the end of the bed, um, I'm gonna go ahead and do the pillows. So I have all king size pillowcases and pillows. And from what I've learned, it's really important to layer the pillows at the front of the bed as well to give you know, a more uh, full filling look, a more fulfilling look on the bed. So I have two king size shams and two king size pillowcases. So let's go ahead and add the pillows. All right, so we have four king size pillows on the bed. So I'm gonna go ahead and put these four pillows up here first at the head of the bed. And what I've learned is that if you have a king size bed, it's good to have two king size pillows on each side before you add the Euro pillows. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, so before I set up these pillows, I actually forgot I want to I want to go ahead and pull back the quilt and the sheet a little bit um, to expose some of the sheet. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. So I've pulled back some of the comforter and the sheet on the bed just so that the inner sheet, the flat sheet was exposed a little bit. I saw that technique, I saw that design on Instagram, Heart and Haven on Instagram. And so I love the way that she decorates, I love the way that she styles her bedding. So I saw that style on her Instagram page where she exposed the flat sheet. So I thought that was absolutely beautiful. Let me go ahead and put the pillows on now and then we will do the next step. So one of the things that I learned about styling a bed is at the end of the bed, you will have this open part here 
and it kind of doesn't really look as attractive or neat if it just kind of hangs open like that. So what I learned was to just tuck it under like this um, when putting the pillow on the bed. I actually turned it this way inward so that it's not exposed on the outside of the bed. Now that we have our king size pillows on the bed and I've positioned them just like this. So now I'm going to go ahead and add the two, I'm sorry, the three Euro pillows and let's see how that looks. All right, so I've added three Euro pillows. I'm wondering if the three pillows is a bit too much and maybe I should just go with two Euro pillows. They are king size. Um, let's just play around with it a little bit. So I have those Euro pillows there. I'm gonna go ahead and add the other two pillows in front of, that, in front of these three pillows. Let's see how that looks. If it's a bit too much, then maybe I'll take one of the Euro pillows off and just keep two up there. the two 20 by 20 size pillows. I think that looks good, but let's just add the 24 by 24 pillows in front of the Euro pillows and let's see how that looks for a second. Okay, I kind of feel like I like having the two 24 by 24 pillows and then the 20 by 20 pillow. I think that looks really nice. I'm trying to decide about the Euro pillows. Let's see, let's just play with it a little bit more and see how it looks. Let me know down in the comments below what you think. If you think I should leave the three Euro pillows there or if you think I should only have two Euro pillows and then have the other two and the one pillow there. And then I have this long lumbar pillow. So I'm just gonna add that right here to the front and see how that looks. So the last thing we just have to add is the knit blanket. So I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add that knit blanket for more layering and texture right here across the end of the bed. The last thing I want to do is to add the two pictures that I bought above the bed right here and then I will show you what everything looks like. So let me go ahead and hang up those two pictures up here. I probably should have done that first <laughs> before making the bed, but that's okay. So let's go ahead and add those two pictures up here and then we will see how everything looks together. So I've hung the two pictures up here and I think they look really nice up there in the space right above the bed. So um, we are done. I'm gonna go ahead and fix the pillows back and then show you guys the full bedding decor. So we are finished. So let me go ahead and give you a full tour of all of the bedding.
All right, so we are done with the bedding. I think everything came out so beautifully. And then those are how the two pictures look, look above the bed. I just love everything, the way it looks. The only thing I did not add was the duvet cover set. Um, so the comforter, the white comforter here would have went inside that duvet cover set. I just really like the comforter itself and felt like the comforter was already extremely heavy. It is actually a very heavyweight comforter and I feel like it could definitely keep you very warm. So I didn't think it was necessary to add the duvet cover set at this time. However, I can always change my, change my mind later and add it later, but I love the way it looks as far as the way it looks as far as the layering I did here. So I did the white comforter and then I added a different color quilt here. And then I also added the knit blanket on top, which I think just makes the bed more elegant and it gives it like another layer there of dimension and there's different textures there as well. So it looks absolutely beautiful. I love all the different pillows I have. There's a lot of different designs and textures here as far as the pillows. So, you know, we have the lumbar pillow and then this is a 20 by 20 and then the two 20 by 24 by 24s. I wasn't actually going to use the 24 by 24s, but I actually think it looks nice with the two 24 by 24 pillows. And then we have the three Euro pillows in the back and then the other four king size pillows um, two on the top are the shams and the other are the king size pillowcases. So I think it looks really good. I'm still a little bit on the fence about the three Euro pillows in the back. So I think they look nice. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm still wanting to, you know, leave them there and see how that will look. If, you know, if it's a bit too much, I can always remove one of the Euro pillows and then just have two of them and I think that will look nice as well as also. Like I said, I love the two pictures up here. Very nice, natural, simplistic. The thing I wanted to show you was how I did the bedding. So I have the other quilt here and then I just fold it back the flat sheet over the quilt, which I think just looks so nice because now you have like many different colors here. You have the flat sheet and then the quilt and then the comforter on top of that and then the other quilt and the knit blanket and all these different colors and layers here just makes the bed look more full and with a lot of different texture. So it just looks really pretty. Let me turn the camera around and we will go ahead and wrap up. So that's it for today's video. I really hope you enjoy how I decorated my master bed. I'm in absolute love with the Casa Luna collection. I think all of the materials are of really good quality, at least from just initial bedding is absolutely amazing. I feel like it's such good quality. The sheets are, they feel very soft and they feel very like solid comforter and the knit blanket as well as the quilts they all feel very heavy weighted so i'm excited to get under the cover and really see how warm you know these make me feel especially here in the maryland area because it is very cold outside right now here in maryland so i'm super excited to see how these hold up to you know that warmth underneath during winter nights and all of the pillows I feel are awesome and they feel very soft. But as far as the Casa Luna bed collection, if you do not have it and you're on the fence and maybe you're thinking about buying Casa Luna pieces, Casa Luna bedding pieces, I would say definitely go for it. It is a bit of a splurge because it is more on the higher end as far as the cost, but it is still cheaper than other bedding options such as Pottery Barn. So I would say definitely look into Casa Luna bedding. It is amazing. Thank you again so much for watching. I will see you all next Sunday. Have a good rest of your week. Bye. Say something meaningful. Say something I don't know.